All right, here we go. We're, we're taking on the fighting club because we just beat Mitch's disciples anyways. Uh, so now we can finally confront Mitch himself. And we'll be doing... This is a weird deck that I just made. But we have two Pokemon Breeders, so we can take advantage of that now with kind of strange lines. Okay, uh, here's Abra. It's C Free Retreat, so it's a bit like Doduo in uh, Execution, but more fragile. Because Psychic doesn't actually resist fighting. Uh, okay, so let's see. Bill. There's a Pokemon Breeder. Alright. Now we can go for Hypnosis Paralysis, yeah. Swap Ghastly in. Can't actually evolve this turn, but what we can do is swap his Hitmonchan up front. Start dealing damage to that. Rare sight of, like, voluntarily putting a Hitmonchan in the active. From the opponent's end, I mean. If you're the player playing Hitmonchan, of course you want him active. Now we get a look at the deck. Yeah, so this deck is built around... I've got Gengar and Alakazam with the Pokémon Breeders to jump directly into them. Um, which lets me run the more, like, risky 2-1-2 lines rather than... This deck doesn't have a full playset of them. Uh, so there's not, like... I don't have the option of going 4-2-4. And then I've got the one Mewtwo promo, of course. So. Computer search. Do I want to hold on to the item finder? Because Ghastly, Ghastly has free retreat anyway, so I don't need the switch in this situation. I might need it on the, uh, Gengar. I will hold on to the item finder. And then Gengar, it's a three energy thing, so we don't get to actually use the attacks immediately. Um, which is why in this situation, like, it's probably better to sit on Ghastly for a bit. I mean, if we did Oak Energy into the discard pile, which, like, we don't right now, of course, we could attach Energy to accelerate that, but it's only three Energy anyway uh, on Gengar, so we'll just go for the Lick. He can't actually get up to 50 damage this turn. And wait, what? Oh, right. Ghastly ghost types resist fighting in this. That's what it is. Because ghost and psychic are both the same type in the TCG, but. So we use Pokemon Breeder, skip directly into Gengar. There we go. And, uh, so we can use Gengar's Pokémon power. Put this onto a Mankey. And Dark Mind. Let's 
So now Mitch is in a pretty difficult position because, like, with Dark Mind, we will basically deal 60 damage every turn to his active because he's. I believe he's a pure fighting deck. Uh. The Dodo -do down to be safe. And then. We'll deal 10 to that Mankey with Dark Mind to pick up two prizes this turn. We'll hold on to. Hey, it's like it's just like 2021. We're a two prize attacker now. Oh, okay. Now he's picking one up. All right. Obviously, discarding one of the oaks. A new basic. Now we'll go for the Abra. Turn to removal. Well, actually, that's kind of pointless to use because it's going to get knocked out this turn anyway. And item fighter requires two discards, so we'll just go straight into Oak from here. Psychic energies out of the deck. Uh, just to thin it and then go for the bills afterwards. A lot of this is just sequencing. That is one of the things that can, that can be kind of limiting about Pokemon from time to time. That I mean, the game is a lot of sequencing, and once you hit the plateau on sequencing, there's not much after that. Uh, one of the things that's nice about the advanced format and Diamond Pearl Platinum is that, like, Basically, the EX era of Pokemon, the first EX era. There's more than just the sequencing going on, there's a lot of timing. There's a bit of there's a bit of counterplay with like uh, Rockets admin. I, I'd like to plus power onto the 10 damage that I deal to the bench, please. Now he's basically guaranteed to lose next turn unless he like gets a different active up and then Mr. Fuji's that or or you know that potion he just used. All right, here we go. Next master medal. I mean, this deck is, in the context of the Fighting Club, it's cheesy. Uh, I, I hesitate to, like, take it to the other clubs, just because it's so specialized on the psychic type. Well, it's probably good at the science club, but next is the challenge cup. Oh, hey, here's the good magmar. Yeah, smokescreen for stall at really any point of the game and then smog for poison damage. So let's save. 